So here's the coaster wheel, and here's the coaster wheel sprocket right here. Uh, on the other side is the coaster brake arm, and that'll attach uh, with a clamp to the frame. And here's the hardware. There is the coaster brake um, clamp. You have to bend it. And this uh, screw and nut goes right here. I'll show you how that works. And these are just the um, axle nuts and washers for the coaster wheel. So here's the coaster wheel. Of course the sprocket right here is um, going on the left side because on the frame the front sprocket for the cranks is on that side as well. Okay, go ahead and put it on. First put it in there and then we're putting on the fender braces. Okay. Okay, now we're putting on the um, the rear one first. Doesn't really matter, but and we put it on the front fender brace second, and looping it in to the rear dropout. And there's the coaster brake arm right there. Okay, next, go ahead and these are the those are the axle nuts, and those are axle washers. Okay, go ahead and put those on. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, next we're going to um, put on the coaster brake arm. There's the cl clamp that attaches the arm to the frame and just a screw and a nut. Okay, go ahead. Let me see. Okay. Um, all right. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Real simple. Okay, next we're going to put on the chain. Here's the chain uh, for this um, stretch cruiser frame with a 26 inch coaster wheel. Um, we use 158 uh, links and that's including uh, the master link. Yeah. So we'll put that on. So go ahead and loop on the chain. This is pre-cut, 158 links, including the master link. Okay, and then just looping on the front. Now we have it wrapped around, and now we're going to connect it with the master link. Okay, here's here is the master link. We're going to connect the two ends of the chain. Go ahead. Go ahead. Let's see that just looped in there. And that just loops in there, and then the connector or the bridge link, and then one more locking link. Let's see that locking link. Yeah, put it in there. Okay. Just take a flathead screwdriver and just kind of jam it back. It snaps into place, and it looks like that. Okay. Now we're just gonna uh, pull the. Uh, coaster wheel back and set it uh, setting it by simply tightening the bolt the rear coaster wheel uh, nuts okay so now we have the chain on master link is in place and now we're just going to pull back the coaster wheel go ahead and the chain will uh, tighten up and now simply take a um, just tighten up the bolts or the nuts on the coaster wheel
Okay, and the other one. Now the uh, chain is um, it's a little bit loose, so we have a bike stand, so we could turn it upside down and use gravity. Uh, so you can tighten it up by pushing the coaster wheel down a bit, Just push it down, and then this is of course tighter. And then you just tighten the uh, coaster wheel nut. Okay, and then you have a tighter chain. Here's our stretch chain guard. All it takes is two little screws. One goes in the back in this hole here, and the other one goes in the front in this bracket hole right here. Stretch chain guard, we're just uh, lining it up. Uh, the front of the frame has a bracket. Go ahead. Just line up that, screw it in. Okay, and then just go to the rear one right here. Go ahead. And go ahead. And then that one just, there's a hole right there. Just line it up. Okay, that's it.